children are getting disease that we've never seen before. There are two diseases that we never before saw in children, type 2 diabetes and fatty liver disease. Prior to 1980, these two diseases were the diseases of alcoholics. Today, we have 30% of children who manifest some form of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, and type 2 diabetes is now approaching the same incidence as type 1 diabetes in children. Sugar and alcohol are metabolized virtually identically in the liver. And it makes sense that that would be the case because after all, where do you get alcohol from? Fermentation of sugar, it's called wine. So the big difference between these two molecules is that for alcohol, the yeast does the first step of metabolism. For sugar, we do our own first step of metabolism. But after that, the liver doesn't care where it came from. And when you overload the liver with either one, you get the same diseases. So we are seeing the diseases of alcohol ravage the entire population of the United States without alcohol. The food industry grosses $1.4 trillion a year, of which 45% is gross profit. That's $657 billion in gross profit. The closest industry to that is Big Pharma at 18%. We, on the other hand, spend $3.2 trillion a year in healthcare of which 75% is chronic disease, of which 75% of that is potentially preventable if we could go back to 1970 rates. So if you do the math on that, that is $1.8 trillion a year going down a rat hole. We spend triple what the food industry makes cleaning up their mess. This is unsustainable. And it's the reason that both Medicare and Social Security are going broke.